Hey there everybody, this is Ray Carcillo and we are here at Star Wars Celebration in Anaheim and the new The Force Awakens trailer just dropped. We're going to talk to some folks and get their opinions on it. There's a moment where Kylo Ren turns around and the camera zooms in on him and he has his lightsaber lit. It's just it's, it's a really cool moment. That's probably tied with Han Solo saying, We're home. And that put a tear in my eye. That moment was just super cool. I'm sitting there going, uh, yes, hey, he, oh, why can't it be, you know, December already? That new scene with the Crash Star Destroyer in the background when it opens up, is it looks amazing. I don't know whose voice that is. It sounds like Mark Hamill, but I'm not sure. It's super exciting. I think for a second there you can see Darth Vader's lightsaber being passed off. And that, is that like Leia passing it to someone new? Plus his helmet in the background, it just looks unbelievable. One of the parts, when Luke was talking, a guy put his hand on R2 and it was a mechanical hand. And it's the same exact hand that Luke got cut off. So I'm pretty sure that was him. So him and R2 seem to be hiding out somewhere. I love the fact Episode Seven's just keeping everything going. And um, I think it's in great hands with JJ. I really do. So I'm, I'm, I'm racked about it. And we freeze framed every minute just to see exactly what was going on in the background because it's happening so fast. It's cool that they're keeping it fresh, but then also updating it. There's things like every time I've watched it again, I've seen something else that I missed. The new X-Wings, awesome. I mean, I had goosebumps, I had tears. It was, it was very an emotional experience.